Well, my business is uh, to manu manufacture robots, and uh, I made this this thing here to kind of help me along and give you some visual representations of what I'm doing. So, so the executive summary is robots work. Like they're in movies, they're in they're in current media, and they're only going to get better. They inspire us to dream about the future and just making life easier, and they, they just reek of the future. With factories, research, support, and marketing, robots will bring the future to today. So uh, I was thinking the form of business ownership, what should I do, partnership, sole proprietorship? I don't think so, I'm going corporation, LLC. We're gonna need funding in the billions. So uh, we're just gonna put ourselves up on the stock market, and it's, it's not gonna be hard to get because robots are a hot ticket item. We're gonna have a lot of, a lot of people looking at us, a lot of people thinking, Whoa, these robots are getting big. So, and then we're going to need to develop almost human AI. Does anyone know what AI is? No. Raise your hand. <laughs> artificial yes, <laughs> artificial intelligence. So, what we're going to need to do to generate this this buzz in the corporate world is get like just I, I wrote here need to pay scientists to push the limits. We need to we need to research research new things. So this is going to cost money, but I don't see any robot robots out there, do you? So I think if I start this, I'll have I'll have a stranglehold on the robot economy. So and uh, I wrote here need to research aerodynamic body styles for robot function. So we're just needing to get a lot of research, a lot a lot of pay, a lot of payment, a lot of billions of dollars, build it up. So bottom line, okay, and. Uh, I named I named a company. It's called Robotica, and the slogan is the only alternative. Because in the future, when when stuff gets crazy and and there's robots everywhere, that that's gonna be the only thing that we need. So bottom line, Robotica needs money to get started. But we'll, we all know, and everyone knows this is true, robots are the eventual remedy to most of life's simple problems. Household taxes, like enforcing enforcement. So. We're going to need a lot of licenses because this is a very new thing. We're going to need business license, fire department permit for the um, factory, robot factory, land zoning permit for the factory, uh, fictitious naming filing. I looked this up and it's to, for to name my company Robotica. And we're going to need environmental health permits and supervision that all is in accordance with the 2006 robot ethical summary, which the main points are robots may never carry weapons unless government issued. Robots may, may not be used for sexual purposes. <laughs> robots <laughs> must aid community, not oppose community. So my marketing plan is pretty big. So the main, the main spiel is who doesn't want a robot doing their housework, keeping their house safe, doing their taxes, and making their dinner, or even being their friend? People thought cars and computers would be too expensive, right? Back in the day. Before Henry Ford came along, and so you know, no one could have no one could have so many cars, you know. But then he said, "Okay, how about an assembly line?" And then you saw how cars. Everyone has a car now. There's like like 20, 20 hundred cars out there in the parking lot. So we need to find the assembly line of robots, the thing that makes it cheap. And once we do that, we're going to have a stranglehold in the market because we're not going to share it with anyone. So, so I have some products, Robotica the elderly helper for uh, rest homes or for your own home if you want your parents to move in to say, oh, I'll have a robot take care of all day and then you, you don't have to pay these extreme prices for elderly homes. You can just have a robot do it. Robotica, the help me. Helping around the house, doing taxes, cleaning your pool. Uh, any ideas? Housework. What can a robot do? Vacuum. What? Vacuum. Vacuum? Cooking. Cooking? Laundry. Laundry. Yes, it's good. Okay, Robotica, the enforcer. This is uh, for maybe like an apartment complex, wants to, ha wants to like buy a robot to keep security around their apartment complex. And finally, Robotica, the friend. Just to kind of a playmate for your children while you're gone. You don't need to hire daycare, you just have this robot. So, advertising. <laughs> <laughs> Advertising before before th this is going on before I before I've made the robots we're gonna become 
we're going to get like a chick ambiguous trendy set of ads going. Just kind of on, online, on, and, and it's only going to introduce the word robotica to the media. So we'll have just some kind of weird ads, and it's going to say, you know, let's see, like a weird picture like that, and then it switches to a robot. And then it says robotica, and that's all it is. People are going, what? And then, <laughs> when I finally get the factory and the robots are there, and then I start this massive scale of like a deluge of robotica media, unleashed on the media. And then we're gonna get like this dog. It's gonna be like a like on the dog, the camera, and then it's gonna look up, and it's gonna be a robot walking the dog. <laughs> and then we'll have like a guy thinking, oh, what's going on? What's going on? And then like a like a robot comes and just says, hey, I'll help you up, I'll help you, help you do what you need to do. So, uh, and then, uh, let me just explain this. These are some robot parts that, that uh, need to be made before, before I can really get this factory going. Uh, these are some hybrid things going on. See the baby and this stuff? It's, uh, it, that's kind of a, a gateway. That's kind of known as the gateway to robots, is like hybrids. And, yeah, I mean, there's a lot going. If you guys have, I'll have a Q&A time after this. You guys can ask me questions. So, um, operation product, we'll have one, one like kind of think lab going on in the beginning to kind of get the get the software and the hardware going. And then once we do that, we're going to have a regular just factory going on for to make the robots. So we're going to have stores and malls online and one superstore in the middle.